Hey guys, Ben Wheeler, the Mercenary King here, here with uh, Vanguard and the Leader set. Honestly, it's a little late for this sort of thing, but hey, I bought it. I got to deal with it now. Uh, promos, great all. Uh, personally, I like it as a combination to Rayon, who is the ace of the deck, uh, of the new Deleters deck, unlike Oxus. Um... Basically, Soul Blast to Grayon, delete your opponent's Vanguard, and your opponent chooses a card from his drop zone, binds a face down, vanish, delete. And then counter blast one with hits a Vanguard, look top five for a Grayon, put it into your soul. Um, search for a card, yep. Shuffle your deck, choose one of your opponent's rear as a front row, retire it, and then banish, delete. Pretty interesting stuff, and honestly, I like him a little bit better than Grayon. But he requires Grayon, so I can't just use him by himself. What a damn pity first pack oh wait one of the finer mats i think they produce they really increased the quality of them honestly uh it shows the great rare which is a deleter boss person thing i've got another one I'll probably sell it let's not kid ourselves huh. why do i have a mat i'm too lazy to open up my damn backpack huh. And first things first, I got a Swift Leader Gailey. <laughs> Gay. <laughs> anyway. I don't know. He's okay. Separate them up a little bit better. So, Hours of Force Unleashed is open today. Friend went to the OC. I'm waiting a bit. Crowd's dying down. Uh, LaRousse. He's alright. Unfortunately, there is a hella lot of deleter reprints in this deck, in these uh, series. So, honestly, you don't have to worry about ooh, Alfred. Uh, you don't have to worry about not getting enough Vanguard cards for you know your Deleter set. But um, honestly, it's it's just not that great when it comes to comms and rares, uh, except for the Royal stuff. June Os. Well, no unit is placed on R due to an effect in your card plus five K. Yeah, it's not too bad. So well, that's actually a really good starter. Yeah, still recording. Huh. Uh, da, da, da. Given. He is actually a very interesting restander. You retire up to five um, delete a rear cards, and you can restand a gray. Oh, Gale Hout. Um. He's pretty good. He sums out an Alfred, uh, even if you don't have one. And so what's good about him is that it honestly can get your um, words. Get It can get a grade uh, fuck. I'm good. I'll, I'll get to it eventually. It can get a stride unit to stand up as long as you have gray. Uh, doll. So, great all, gray one, you know, whatever. It's all good, man. It's all good. Uh, so, honestly, I'd run him one or two simply just to have the restand. Ooh, who is this gray one? Gray on? Eh. Uh, just to get the restand. Because that's six cards to hand or more, especially if you're running, say, um, draws. And you should really run draws. I mean, it's, uh, you know, you'd be dumb not to. Ooh, SP given. Son of a bitch. Not the best SP to get. But I guess I know what my winning image is. Huh. That guy's like five bucks. Goddamn. Couldn't have gotten the gray one. Couldn't have gotten a great rare. Huh. Madu is a 
rare now. Uh, it's actually one of the better cards. Another Junos. Out there, because what it is, is he, if you have a uh, Vanguard with 10k or less, like, say, a Legion, um, you can actually return the grade 3 to hand. And that will actually do pretty good. You know, and it sets up for combos, like Dark Rex. You can, you, you can resummon, you can pay Dark Rex to stride, and because you either have a Legion or you have a 10k with Dark Rex, because the Break Ride doesn't really work for him. Um, okay. Uh, you can basically put him back, pay it, so he gets a lot of use out of it. And it actually upgrades um, Tachikaze a bit. However, they're still not, still not par for course. There's some new shit coming out with the uh, Reckless Rampage booster set, uh, especially if he, when we're getting Rex support. Uh, yeah, you know, it's pretty great. Wow, I got like three Junos. I bet I'm going to get like all four. It's going to be pretty, pretty balling. I'm lying, but <laughs> and I'm actually pretty uh, looking forward to that. Yep. Plenty of Madus. Also, Madu can really upgrade older decks in general. Like it's not just decks that have it, but like things like um, old Alfred uh, without the stride. Another great one. Um, you know things like Solus Ott, uh, which is getting their own stride, which is <laughs> discard two cards or you take a damage. Now this guy I don't really care for. Put this unit into the soul, choose a card from your hand, discard it. At the end of the battle, this unit boosted your vanguard with the leader in the name. You pay the cost of you to draw two cards. The opponent vanish deletes a card. Um, it does work if you have a deck based around vanish delete, but I've never ever seen um, vanish delete kill somebody. And there's a great rare in here that lets you kill somebody if they have 15 or so, or is it 13? I forget which. Uh, cards to vanish delete. Nearly done here, guys. Bear with me. It doesn't look like I'm getting him anytime soon. Uh, on the other hand, this gets me all the royal paladins and whatnot I needed. So that's why I tolerated it. Ooh, another gay halt. Gale halt. Gale halt. <laughs> Man, I don't even care anymore. I'm just two weeks from retirement. No, there's actually a game that was being made on Kickstarter. I don't know whether it succeeded or not. But it's pretty funny. It's like three days from retirement or something like that. And you're a cop on the edge who's looking to solve his last crime before he retires in three days. And apparently it's all the commander of craziness and whatnot that you can do with it. Don't know if it succeeded, but I kind of hope they did. It was an interesting idea. Honestly, I don't have friends enough who play board games. So the, ew, this guy, Zale... He was a triple rare back in the day, and now he's a double rare. I've got two more packs. Come on, Igorg. Come one more pack. Come on, Igorg. Or another gray wand. Come on. Ooh, it's something. It's it's a... Oh, it's an alms. Uh, which ain't bad. Honestly, I needed another alms uh, for my deck. But at the same time, I didn't get the great rare. And the SP I got was lackluster. Um... So, let me do a quick stuff. Honestly, this wasn't too bad. I got a lot of stuff I needed. Um, but the sad thing is, is that this deck, uh, none of this stuff is valuable. Maybe if uh, I had been a bit more on the ball and gotten it earlier, uh, maybe it would have been a little bit more worthwhile to have. But hey, an SP is nice, even though it's for a grade 2, that's not only really a tech. The two gray ones are nice. And the two Gale Halts and the Amas are also nice. Junos is K, and I might replace a couple cards in my Royals deck, which I completely forgot to bring. So I'm just going to stick these into my binder and hope they trade. This guy is probably the best of the grade twos in the Sit deck. Like him and him is kind of, eh, I guess. But it's like, um, you know, what he does is he's a 11k attacker with an Al Alfred. They kind of bless when it hits a Vanguard uh, Alfred card name. Search your deck for a blaster blade, which I run four of. Call it to R, and its use is free. It's nice. You know, it's, it's really nice. That combined with the Great Alls, uh, 
uh, I'm sure I'm going to pull up something pretty cool here. Uh, whip it up. The thing is, I need two more rayons. Fortunately, they're not exactly the most expensive card in the set. None of this is. Um, and so we'll have some fun, I think. Also, this guy works with snow gulls. I just thought I'd mention it. Alfred and the snow gulls. Does work. All right. Uh, yeah, that's everything. This has been Ben Wheeler, the Mercenary King. Have a great day. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a great card fight. Thank you.